Welcome back to another episode with Picks and Web. Today, I'm kicking off a new series dedicated to the 200 plus ranking factors that Google uses to determine the position of a website within the search engines. But before we get started, I wanted to give you some um, history about this topic. It's a popular topic because SEO specialists and website owners ha all have a, an interest in determining how can they rank their websites better in the search engines? So does anybody really have a complete list of all the ranking factors that Google uses? Yes, somebody does, and it's the people behind Google. Other than that, uh, people have been speculating based on um, historical data, some A-B testing, and some correlations about why certain websites rank well and why others don't. So in this series, we're gonna look at each of the ranking factors that people speculate and believe are what Google uses. And we're gonna come to a determination. Is this a myth? Is it a fact? How important is the ranking factor uh, in determining your position within the search engines? And what can you as an individual do about this, uh, the, the, the ranking factor to improve your, your position in the search engines? So stay tuned to this series. We're gonna go over each of the speculated and known 200 plus ranking factors that Google uses. But just note this, the best way to rank your website prominently in the search engines is really not you know, a secret. It's develop a great website that's coded properly, um, that's semantically coded, is, uh, it performs well within the browsers, has a lot of high quality content that comes out on a consistent basis. So it's a well-coded website, quality content that comes out consistently. That is the foundation of SEO. Once you do that, then we go deeper into building links that are reputable links into your website, not, you know, um, not a fly by night links that could actually hurt your website. And then obviously promoting your, your website in social media. But those are some of the foundations of SEO. And in this series, we're gonna go beyond that and just talk about the 200 ranking factors and what they mean for you. Stay tuned.